Welcome to episode 16. So, my plan for this episode is to get all requirements, all quests, and all items for Recipe for Disaster ready. Like, I want to get everything absolutely done, and then I want to do Recipe for Disaster on the following episode, like, in one episode, which I think will be pretty interesting. So, I want to get, like, monkey bones and stuff for the monkey madness part. I want to get... Oh, 45 people. I want to get every single item I'm going to need, and then I'm going to, like, try and finish the recipe for disaster as quick as I can. I won't do, like, speed run or anything, but I want to, like, I want to see if I can do it, like, in one login. So, anyway, that's the future episode, and right now I'm just going to make some prayer pots, because I know I'm going to have to burst some bosses in Horror for the Deep, and also Desert Treasure, because those are some of the two quests I still have to do. So, yeah, that's it so far. So I've just decided to do some more AFK range training, and I'm about to get 68 range. So I'm probably just going to stay here until the end of my darts. Um, I hope they'll get me 70, but they'll more likely just get me 69. But either way, these darts have been very helpful. So I'll update you when I have no more darts left. So just finishing off my last few darts here, I got pretty close to 70 range, only 25k away. So that's pretty good. I'm now going to go quickly do my dailies and then probably do the quests I need to get done. So yeah, this training was pretty good. All darts gone, but I'll probably go make more later as well. The first thing I want to do is make my overgrown cat, which I obviously got during training range, into a wily cat or something. So I've never done this before. Let's see how it works. Okay, so I finally decided it's time to finish off these quests. Uh, I started with Troll Stronghold, and I'm just about to finish it now. was very quick, and now I've only got, I think, two more to do. Desert Treasure and Horror from the Deep, so they'll be a little bit harder, but that's fine. So 163 quest points, and I can now make Law Runes. Well, with that rune crafting. Alright, so I guess now I'll do Horror from the Deep. Yeah, I'll do Horror from the Deep now, so I'll go do the Bark Roll. So just finishing off the bar crawl, this will be the last one. Wasn't too bad, it was only like 10 minutes or so. I've also got a new kitten, I haven't trained a kitten in ages, but I decided just in case something happens to my wily cat, I should get a normal cat as well. So... I... Yep, I finished it, perfect. Alright, i just quickly go help my friend with something, some part of heroes, and then I'm off to do Horror from the Deep. Okay, so I just have the two boss fights to go, I think. I think the first one, just normal. Big Dagonoff, and then the next one is the one where I have to use special types. I think it's just whatever color they are is the type you have to do it by. So like red is fire and all that, so I don't think it's too hard. Cranially, it's the case. Okay, and I guess I'll fast forward these parts. All right, and there we go. That was. I think I did pretty bad, but I think, I think I found a pretty good safe spot. That was so weird. Alright, so two quest points, and 49 strength. Alright, so the last quest I have to do is Desert Treasure, and the only requirement I need for that still is 53 Thieving. Now, I've never done Pyramid Plunder before, but I just could not be bothered doing, um, doing Thieving by, like, Master Farmers or something. So I'm going to try this, and unless it's really, really bad, I'll probably just stick to this to 53, and then I'll do Desert Treasure. So that is 52 Thieving. I am very bad at Pyramid Plunder, but I am enjoying this, because I've never done it before, and I don't really know what I'm doing, but it's, uh, it's kind of interesting. So one more level to go, and I don't know how long it's going to take, but I'll come back with it. Alright, so back to level 53 Thieving. This was pretty interesting, only took two invents, and I know I did it wrong, like, I don't know what I'm doing here, I'm just pretty much running into rooms and trying to get treasure, so, yeah, this was pretty good. Uh, I'm now gonna go get lockpicks, or well, after the system update, I'm gonna go get lockpicks and do desert treasure, I guess. So, yeah, I'll be back for that. Okay, so just about to fight the first boss of desert treasure, I'm pretty sure this is not too hard, so let's go. I didn't realize he had that much HP, but that was not too bad.
Okay, so one more boss to kill. Steal from this chest, see how long it takes. Alright, got it, wasn't too hard, there's only like 10 chests. Alright, so this is the final guy. Run. Okay, so he's finally dead, and I got the diamond now. Let's get out of here. Ah. Alright, so I just have to do this last run, so we'll see how it goes. Alright, so that was pretty easy. Every time I've done this quest, I've never really fallen down, so... Can't complain. This will just be the finishing. So I might as well do the Christmas event. Alright, so just finishing the holiday event. So I was just looking at the Recipe for Disaster item guide, and I realized I needed sweet corns. Luckily I had three sweet corn seeds in the bank, but only three. So I'm literally watching this grow, and if it ever gets diseased or anything, I'm gonna fix it. Because I couldn't get the payment for it, so I'm just standing here waiting for it to grow and make sure I get the sweet corns otherwise I have to get sweet corn seeds some other, how, some other way so once these finally grow I'll pick them. Okay so I had no problems with the harvest and now I have the sweet corns for recipe for disaster which is very good and I just go get the other items now. So one of the reasons I haven't trained my melee stats is because I've never had a good melee weapon like I never attempted to get a rune sim and I think like the one I've been using so far has been a rune battle axe which I got from a hard clue but I always knew I could get an Ancient Staff, which is better than a Rune Sim eventually anyway. So I decided I might as well not train my melee stats until I get it. And I finally got it, and now I have a melee weapon which I can train to 60 attack and use my, until I can use my Dragon Sim. So it's pretty good. So one of the last things I have to do to get prepared for Recipe for Disaster is get all the Monkey Grigris. So I've already bought, I already have these from the quest, uh, Monkey Madness. And now I'm just going to go get the bones and make them into proper grigris, and then I should be pretty much prepared for next episode. So just getting my first pair of monkey bones. It's not too hard as long as you uh, far cast this one so he doesn't heal up. So the next one I'll do is probably the zombie bones in the underneath the ground here, and then I got to go get the archer bones I think. So if I ever hit this guy, I'll pick up his bones. So that's the first set of bones. And now I'm poisoned, great. Alright, let's go get a second one. Alright, so that's the second set of bones. And now let's go get the third. Alright, and that's the third set. Alright, and that's all the monkey talismans, so... Pretty good. One of the last things I have to complete is make some Rings of Recoil because there's quite a few boss fights coming up in the next, well, with Recipe for Disaster, so I want to make enough Rings of Recoil so I don't have to do too much damage to myself. So the last thing I want to do before I end my episode is I actually do want to make some more energy pots, so I need some Harlanders because I have none in the bank, and I thought, well, the easiest way to do that is by Miscellanea. So let's check I have enough cash. Ooh, I like to some more. So with these, I'm going to make energy pots, but I won't worry about recording those. And then I'll be all prepared for next episode where I do Recipe for Disaster. So let's have a quick check. What was a lot of maples? Uh, so 29 Highlanders, very nice. And 11 Renards, so pretty good as well. Alright, so thanks for watching. Didn't get much done this episode, but did get Desert, Desert Treasure done, so I guess that's not too bad. And I guess I'll see you for a special episode next time.